Hi everyone, Papa Stanimus here. Today, I'm going to fill a very, very popular request, and that is, how do you make the crosshair cam? Let me demonstrate. Let me demonstrate, all right? The crosshair cam is a really cool element for your stream because it shows how bad you are at shooting stuff. Like me, see, look at this, oh, I'm so, oh, actually, I'm doing all right. I missed that one. It's small corrections I hear, you know? It's not about the big flick, flick, yeah, yeah. You know, it's the, get close, small corrections. Slow and steady, all right? Should we pay, calm. There we go. This is what my coach was telling me. The coach of the Game Rebel Esports team. He was giving me a private lesson. He's like, it's small, the small corrections. Anyways, by the way, the Marshall has a 98% hip fire accuracy rate. Isn't that interesting? Let's show how we make one of these things, shall we? Let me do this. All right, I've got this all ready to go. I'm going to uh, open up uh, OBS right here, and we're going to go, bam. We're going to chill right here. Now, we're going to build one from scratch on this other copy of OBS I have running, okay? So check this out. All right, we're, we're here fresh. I'm just chilling. We have no crosshair cam. I'm going to show you what I did. Now, um, the, for different games, you might have to do different types of capture methods. For Valorant, I found I had to do a window capture in order to get the game captured, okay? So I'm doing a window capture. Uh, some games need a, a game capture. Some games need a display capture. Whatever type of capture you have to use as a source within OBS, do it, okay? This will work for all of them. For Valorant... Uh, very rarely, I had to use a window capture. Game capture just would not work for me. Maybe it'll work for you. Different computers, different whatever, right? Anyways, let's get started. So, what I do, what I did is I created a window capture. You can see it right here. And in fact, I'm just going to, uh, I'm going to go ahead and make a new scene altogether. I'm just going to create, call it scene two, and we're going to start this all over again, okay? So, I'm going to go window capture, and I already have it added, okay? And I'm just going to go ahead and use this one. Uh, create new looks like this. Actually, we'll create a new one right here. Look at that. I got Valorant. I'm creating a new one. All right, we're just going to call it window capture. Fuck that. I don't like that. I'm going to rename it something. Okay, we're going to call it window capture Valorant demo. All right, I'm just going to name it for demo for me. Okay, there we go. So we have two Valorant captures. So we have a whole new source added. Now uh, you can notice it's not fitting in there. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, do a fit. I'm going to go transform and fit to screen. There we go. That makes things easy. Now, um, I hope that my camera is not in the way. I'm going to move. I'm going to grab that real quick. Can I do that? Let's do this. Let's move. Let's move this stuff over here. We'll go up top. Okay. I'm just going to go right up here. That looks fine. Whatever. Good enough. Now, um, uh, to do this, all you have to do is add a, add that source all again. Okay. You have to have two of them Add two of them. So we're going to do another window capture. I'm going to add the Valorant demo that I already made. Okay. There we go. Look at that. Now we have another Valorant demo. What I'm going to do instead of fitting to screen, I'm just going to drag it because fitting the screen is causing some weird issue. Okay, there we go. So as you guys can see, I just started over, but I just made the second copy very small. Okay, so I have the second one. It's very small. Now what I'm now that uh, if you do fit to screen and then you try and crop the size, it causes weird things to happen. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm actually cropping and I'm going to crop uh, all the way to the middle. It's kind of hard to see my crosshair, but I'm going to crop sometimes and you have to get a lot closer than you think. You just kind of hold down alt and you grab the edges here and you crop these in. And we're going to make a little rectangle. Okay, we're going to try the best we can. Make a little rectangle. There we go. Now what we want to do is let go of alt. And we're going to make this bigger. Look at that. And bam, you have a crosshair cam right there. You can make, now you want to try and get it just right in the middle. Like uh, I try and get my crosshair right in the middle between all the dots, you know. So I feel like we need to uh, crop up a little bit. Get There we go. Crop up just a little bit. And then maybe crop to the left just a little bit. Get that just a little bit more centered. And it looks pretty centered. I got that pretty good, as you guys can see, right? And um, and then there you go. Now, you can add like a little overlay. Let's add an image. Let me, uh, I should have a, I'll just add it. Where is it at? Let's see here. Hopefully it's on my downloads or something. Looking for my crosshair cam overlay, right? So I made like a little overlay. I'll make a, a download uh, section for you guys, okay? So you can have this overlay. Here we go. I just found it. Here's my crosshair cam. Look at this. So this is the Game Rebel crosshair cam. This is what everyone saw and they've been asking me like crazy. Like, how do I get that? So I'm making this tutorial for all you guys. They keep asking me. So as you can see, what I'm doing here is I'm uh, I'm just kind of getting the, the the overlay just right, right over the top, and bam, there it is. There's our crosshair cam once again. Look at that. It's simple as that. Let's do some shooting, shall we? So we have our crosshair cam. Uh, oh, I can't do any any shooting. Well, I guess I can't shoot because the way I'm capturing us, big ripperoni. Oh, I could show you on the other one. Here we go. We'll just go from here. So. There's that, that crosshair cam. If I go back to my, uh, my Valorant right here, right? You can see this. So this is the same concept, just different. I did it on a different computer. I'm going to try and shoot this guy from OBS on my other computer. 
Hey, look at that. Where's this other one? Where's it at? Right here. There you go. Crosshair cam. <laughs> so people love this, especially when you're really good or if you're uh, streaming pe other people that are really good. Someone else might be really good and you can uh, you can use their skills for your own content. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Get those viewers that are good to come in there and show everyone. Dude, I'm missing so bad. This is the... Okay, let me try doing it this way. No! No! Oh my god! All right, all right, all right. All right, small corrections, right, Panda? That's what Panda told me. Told me small corrections. Fuck, dude, I suck. I, su I, sh I don't even deserve to have this game. I don't even deserve I just gotta shoot him in the... In the oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm so bad. I'm so bad. Crosshair cam, everybody. Behold how much I suck at this game. Guys, thank you very much for uh, watching this. And uh, if you have any questions, if I mess something up in my tutorial, I kind of went fast here. Let me know. I'll help anyone out in the in the comments. It's so easy to do this, okay? You just double up your, your game source, and then you crop it and zoom in, all right? And if you want to download to the Game Rebel Crosshair Cam, that'd be sick, dude. I'd love for you guys to, to uh, represent what Game Rebel is all about. We're all about helping streamers, making you guys better, making you guys excellent, making you guys be successful, all that stuff. So thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next quick tutorial.